It is a flyweight championship fight between Henry Cejudo and Demetrius Johnson. Ready. Let's see how he approaches this matchup. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Blocks the shot. Oh, he got absolutely bludgeoned. Oh! He's getting lit up right now, John. He's got him right here. certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the feet. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Hands high, hands high. Oh! Oh, man. I think you jumped out. What a wrestler. That was an amazing takedown. Well, he's up. But, oh, is he hurting. Look at how he turns his hip to that leg. Beautiful combination of punches to the head. He gets tagged again. <laughs> Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back in range. Leg kick. And he landed the right hand there. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Straight right hand, no good. Right hand by Henry. Quick level change now. He went single into a high crotch. Oh, he's taking his dude for a ride. Oh. He flips him over the top. What a fantastic takedown. Welcome to the Cormier Express. <laughs> That's a big strike right there. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Beautiful head kick. Try to establish that jab. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he is up, but man, is he hurt. A finish could come here at any time. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great, great job of mixing everything up. First strike. Oh, big left. That strike blocked by the ever-improved Henry Cejudo. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand. Great hand punch. That's as good a punch as he's thrown. The punch that lands down the middle, the one that you don't feel, is the ones that land perfect, and that one landed perfectly. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a three. Inside, let's go. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we go with round two. Now, on a quick entry. Great single entry. Rotates the high punch, taking it for a ride. Takes it for a ride. Slams him on his back. What a takedown. How's that feel to be on the wrong end, end of that? Not, I mean, honestly. <laughs> I knew I was coming. <laughs> now he falls back into the finishing position. Not tapping out tonight. All right, full guard here, DC. We'll see how soon he tries to pass. Well, he needs to be passing immediately. In the full guard is where you are in most danger as a top fighter because they have all of their submissions. They have the guillotine, they have the arm bar, they have the kimuras, they have all their locks when they're in the full guard. So if you pass, you really do limit the danger that you're in from the top position. Quick entry to get Man, in on a single. Man, that was a great single. Oh. Big slam takedown. That was beautiful. 
Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground. Step for step, he's staying with his opponent in every transition. Oh, looks like he's transitioning on ball. You cannot stay in the guard of these great jiu-jitsu guys. And attack an armbar. You gotta recognize that when a guy starts to put his feet on your hips, you gotta move him off, and you gotta cover. You can't be off to an angle. Now he falls back into the finisher position. So he submits him with the arm bar. I mean, just steps ahead of the competition. Where you're playing checkers, he's playing chess in the ground fighting. And it showed tonight in this big submission victory. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger in finishing fights. So the celebration is on for the UFC flyweight champion of the world, your winner tonight by submission. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at two minutes, 38 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out due to an arm bar. Well, you talk about coming in and seizing the hardware. How about it for the new UFC flyweight?